gates are back and they on their journey. Apollo's gift was slow along with Phoebus. Ice run on the money and running by a length and a half. Hello, Mr. Keen on the outside moved up into second, looking to settle into his stride. Towards the outside, Roy's power. Coleman's not far off the action. Sharp Seattle's racing in the red silks. Then comes Quintella to the inside. Delicious Damowin, Gurkha Chief, Apollo's Gift and Phoebus has nine lengths to hunt down. Homeward bound, Ice Run has the lead by two. Hello, Mr. in stalk mode in second. Coleman's going to go through at the rail. Got his three lengths to make up. Towards the outside, Roy's Power tries to get closer and then Sharp Seattle. Ice Run continues to go as they come to the last 200 metres. Hello, Mr.'s now going to apply the pressure. Apollo's gift running on. Ice Run's digging down. Hello, Mr.'s on the inside. Ice Run in a real battle. The last bit, he's pulling out a little bit more and yes, Ice Run for the victory. From Hello, Mr. and then came Roy's power, Quintella behind these. Now here's a horse who's enjoyed the drop to the thousand meter trip and ice run. He's a horse who's got the abilities, come right down in the ratings and Brandon Arena gets the best out of ice run. Well done to the Tony Riverland stable. Pays up at 15 rand 10, 2 rand 80. He's a horse we've been watching very closely in his recent runs and the thousand meters he pulls it out the fire ice run. Hello Mr. Sick and Roy's power and then came Quintella. Sharp Seattle, Apollo's Gift. Delicious Damowin, Coleman. So, Ice Run, Brandon Arena just sitting and asking him for maximum coming to the 200. He's just trying to hold and save a little bit for reserve. And that's when Hello Mister gets alongside. And the last 50 meters, Brandon says, come on Ice Run, I know what you're capable of. Let's find that little bit extra. Drifting to the inside, but Ice Run wins it. Well done to Mary Liley and the Cassims, bred by the Backward Stud. Please note there is a race review into the closing stages. There is a race review into the closing stages. Number three, Ice Run. He's a son of Western Winter from the Tony Rublin stable. Tony, if you'd like to join us in the number one box here with Ice Run. Now, he's a horse I've been keeping a close eye on. He's just been lacking a finish. You decided to drop him to the thousand. Yes, um, Sheldon. Rather disappointing horse. He does too much in a race up front. And although he won a 1,400 first time out the maiden, so he followed up his maiden win. Um, I thought, well, he's going to be reasonable if he can go start to finish in a 1400. But he lost his way. He's very temperamental. He gets very excited at the races, sweats up. So it's difficult for him and always in front and he doesn't relax in front. Look, he's dropped a huge amount in the ratings. And so obviously coming down to a field of this, this caliber, you know, in terms of ratings, he had to have some sort of chance. And obviously I think the conditions suited him. 1,000 meters, he was looking, you know, possibly he'd had enough at the end. 1,000 um, meters. Drop in rating, I think, with a tailwind, it, it was, and well done to Brandon, you know. Brandon can keep them going, you know. Super. Thank you, Sheldon. Brandon Marina and Asra. So well done to Mary and Kasim. Please for them. Note there is that race review in progress. It is hold on to the tickets. But he seemed to dig in the last 100. Yeah, he found another gear, and uh, there was a little bit left in the tank. I think it was a good win. Although everything was pointing in the, in the right direction for him. A handicap drop as well as a tailwind tonight and a decent draw. And uh, he won a good race. Well done to, to Mr. Rivlin and his team. And thanks to Mrs. Lali. Congratulations, Brandon. Thank you. Once again, thanks to all fleet. Brandon Arena bringing home number three, Ice Run. Just hold on to those tickets. We'll be back shortly if there's any further action.